All right, what is going on YouTube? Foxy Girl, welcome to you guys today with a brand new video. And in today's video, we're going to be doing some MW3 sniping. So I hope you guys do enjoy. If you guys do, make sure you guys leave a like down below, subscribe, turn on notifications. Use code FOXY for 10% off your order at gfield.com. Without further ado, let's go, bros. So this video has been highly requested for a while. I've gotten multiple like tweets and multiple comments, actually a lot of comments, saying... Can you please do MW3 sniping? Can you snipe on MW3? When's the MW3 sniping video coming out? Because of that, here we are. All right, so we're on mission. This is a great sniping map, actually. We got some news today. Well, I, I, we've got just a lot of news that's going on and just going around and everything. So apparently, if you guys aren't on Twitter and everything like that, you guys don't know what's going on, really, and that, that's okay. Apparently, the next Call of Duty game is not Modern Warfare 4. Apparently, it's just called Call of Duty Modern Warfare. And if you ask me, I'm not gonna be upset about that. Oh, well, that sucks. I, that could've been a nice collat right there. So, what do you guys think about that? Like, it's it's leaked, and it's pretty much confirmed, but, there's the, but there hasn't been a reveal yet. That's the thing. There's no confirmation, but there is, there's like people on Twitter who have confirmed it pretty much. Come on, dude. There we go, there's one. Like I said, I don't know the truth behind this. I don't really know what's going on exactly. Nope. It's like, it kind of makes sense, but then it doesn't, you know? There's also, an, there's also another leak that came out yesterday that said that the campaign for Modern Warfare is going to have, like, huge balls, apparently. Apparently, the campaign is going to revolve around terrorism, very similar to No Russian, and it's gonna have modern terrorism in it, which is uh, pretty crazy if you think about. And honestly, I kinda like this move. I'm not gonna lie. I kinda like this move. And here's why I like this move. Call of Duty has not had balls in a long time. Their games haven't had huge balls in a long time. For me personally, what makes the old COD games like really good is the fact that they had balls, they took risks, they took chances. And apparently that's what we might get with this new Call of Duty game. And that would be absolutely insane. I'm not saying that I want to go shoot a place up or something like that, but I just want a Call of Duty game to take some risk. And I said it in the stream last night because the, the gaming intel leak that came out last night talked about the, the no Russian stuff. And and I said to everybody, if they're gonna do ballsy stuff, they gotta do it with the Modern Warfare series because they can't do it with any other series. They just can't, it doesn't work like that with COD anymore. They can't do it with the Black Ops games because the Black Ops games, in my opinion, the Black Ops games have become way too friendly. They become way too like kid friendly. We haven't seen a Modern Warfare game in a long time. It's been almost 10 years. I'm telling you guys, man, they can't do ballsy stuff with the Black Ops games anymore because they've just been so kid-friendly recently. So, like, they just can't do it. It just won't happen. I, I literally don't see it happening. And if Black Ops 5 is ballsy, then I'll take back what I just said. I should probably mention this because I keep forgetting to mention it in my other videos. But how does he kill me? Okay. So, if Modern Warfare 4 is the next Call of Duty and this Call of Duty Modern Warfare isn't true... I'm gonna dye my beard green, but like if it's not Modern Warfare 4, I don't know what color to dye my beard. So like if you guys could help me with that, that'd be cool. It can't be rainbow, it can't be pink, and it can't be green. I guess pick a color out of all of those. I've actually been talking to people on Twitter as well about it.
So guys, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Do you guys want the next Call of Duty to have balls or not? Let me know down in the comments. Because I do, personally. I really do, honestly. Oh. Nice, nice. Oh. They're just running at me here, bros. Well, we got a heli. Okay, okay, okay. Is he in last stand? What a noob! You're using a sniper and you're in last stand? Why? Dude, the MSR. I hope that the MSR comes back. Hold on, we're actually gonna throw this up. Later. Wow, it took out my heli. That's awesome. So with this news coming out, it just gets me thinking about a bunch of things and I want to know what you guys think of these leaks and everything else that's been said and talked about so far. So I'm going to tell you guys what I think is going to happen and you guys can, you know, take with it what you will because everyone seems to think that today is going to be the reveal because, you know, MW2 got teased on the 22nd, MW3 got teased on the 23rd or revealed or whatever. And then, you know, today's the 24th, so people are like, oh, well, obviously MW4 is going to get, or revealed, it's going to get revealed on the 24th. But I have a different theory. So, you guys remember how Syndicate and, like, a couple other YouTubers were like, oh, we can't talk about our non-disclosed agreement until the 30th? Yeah. That's when I think they're going to reveal the game. I think that they're going to wait until the 30th to reveal the game. Because, I mean, it just makes the most sense, in my opinion. You know, why wouldn't they reveal it? There might be a teaser. Maybe. There's just so much hype. And, and personally, in my opinion, I don't want there to be, like, a teaser. You guys know how Call of Duty, like, usually teases a game, bef like, a day or so before it comes out. Yeah, see, I don't want COD to do that this year. I want them to just kind of give us the reveal and have us wondering the entire week. I would love that because that's just, like, I don't know. I feel like that's just kind of old school. You know, the, which is what pretty much Modern Warfare is. It's like an old school type of feeling for a game. Okay, so MW4 or Modern Warfare, like, I'm just going to refer to them as, you know, each individual, like, game. Like, I'm not, I'm just going to call it, like, what I, as I see it. You know, whether it's MW4 or it's just Modern Warfare. In the next COD game, I would like to see them bring back the point system. If you guys remember the point system in uh, MW3, you guys remember that, like, if you played the objective, you got a point. If you got a kill, then you got a point. You know, things like that. I think that would be really cool to see. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of tired of score streaks. And even the point system encourages team play and, you know, objective play still. So, I'll give it to the Modern Warfare games, though. They're really tough to snipe on, at least in my opinion. You know, if you're a sniper, I mean, you can pretty much snipe anywhere, I would, I would feel like. But, like, for me personally, of course. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! For me personally, I think that sniping is really tough in this game and in MW2. It's just... I don't know. I, I just feel like it is. I, I, I'm just not a sniper, so I guess that's probably why I feel that way, but I feel like sniping is one of the hardest things to do in Call of Duty, it, at least like quick scoping with sniping and things like that. I feel like it takes like a lot of fucking skill in order to like quick scope and snipe and things like that. All right, so we got the L11-8A sniper. This is one of the cooler bolt action sniper rifles that I don't think we've ever seen come back in a COD game, actually, now that I think about it. God, I've never used this sniper, honestly. But I'm willing to just kind of like use it for the video, for sure. I hope that this sniper rifle comes back, and the MSR, and the Barrett, honestly, with the intervention. Imagine all those, all three of those snipers in the same game. Wouldn't that be fucking insane? That would be fucking awesome, in my opinion. Goodbye. This is also another really sweet-sounding sniper rifle. Call of Duty 4, all the way until Black Ops 2, all the guns had like a real distinct, like awesome sound to them, in my opinion. So guys, let me know down in the comments what you guys think of these leaks and the quote-unquote new game being called Modern Warfare instead of just Modern Warfare 4 or something like that. What do you guys think of it being called Call of Duty Modern Warfare? Double 
kill. I think it's really crazy how people still use Final Stand and, you know, Last Stand and shit like that in this game. I think it's really fucking weird. Holy shit, dude. I don't even know. Dude, they're all camping, too. Why? They're camping with... This is an MW2. What the fuck is going on? Goodbye. So there's one guy that's sitting back there. And the others are just kind of camping in another spot. Oh, my God. He would have gotten destroyed. All right, guys. That's going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys did, make sure you guys leave a like down below. Subscribe. Turn on notifications. Let me know what you guys think about all these leaks and things like that. When do you guys think we're going to get the reveal trailer or a teaser? Let me know down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.